Hey, welcome back. This is our presentation and pre-recorded video. If you were not on the Zoom call or if you missed the Zoom call, also we're going to play it during Zoom. So if you need to go back to this video, you can. Um, this is Zoom 101. Keep your video on. Stay muted unless you are talking. Unless we call on you for talk, please stay muted. We don't want to hear what's going on in your house. Number three, if you want to share, you need to write in the chat or raise your hand virtually on the participant tab or physically and somebody will call on you. Number four is silent sharing. Um, thumbs up, thumbs down. You guys are really good at that. Um, just let us know if you understand things or if you're confused at all. Expectations we have for everyone in the camp. Respect others by listening and when your turn to speak or draw, be kind and positive. It is so important to be positive because if you're not positive, then you're just mad all the time and no one wants to be mad all the time. Number three, if you need to leave your screen, ask a counselor in the chat or raise your hand before leaving and just let one of the five of us know. There's five counselors. There's Miss, Miss Yeye, Mr. Connor, Miss Ariana, me, and other Miss Kaylee or Miss Sierra. Either one, you just need to let us know that you're leaving. Um, number four, participate, ask questions, share your ideas. We love when you guys talk back to us and tell us how you feel about things, tell us what you want to do. Anything you suggest for us to do, we will probably try. Number five, have fun. That is the most important thing. We are here to have fun, so we want you to have fun. The schedule for today from 1 to 110 is welcome and getting comfortable. From 110 to 115 is our expectations. From 115 to 125, we're going to do an energizer called repeat after me. And then 125 to 130, we're going to do a break. And then 130 to 155, SEL COVID with Miss Jasmine. But this week, it won't be with Miss Jasmine. It'll be with Miss Yaya. And then from 155 to 2 o'clock, it's going to be a little break. So you guys can get up, stretch, exercise a little bit. And then from 2 o'clock to 2.25, we're going to do Thursday, Thursday, which is our fitness. We're going to watch a catch video. It's going to be a little long, so grab a snack and make sure you're paying attention. And then from 2.25 to 2.30, we're going to wrap up, do conclusion, answer any questions you have, let you know what's going on for the next day and everything. And then from 2.30, 3.30, we do have office hours for any extra help. Also, um, if you want to just play a game for 10, 15 minutes, you do get points for coming to office hours. And if you get enough points, you will get a prize. So do with that information what you will. We would really appreciate if you guys stayed on for office hours. Our energizer is repeat after me. Okay, now that we have done our energizer, we are going to go into a break. That's going to be from 125 to 130. So you have five minutes to get up, use the bathroom, get a drink, get a snack. And while you are doing that, don't forget to tell us your favorite TV channel in the chat. Personally, my favorite TV channel is Cartoon Network. But go ahead, take your break, and be back by 130. Okay, we are going to move on. Everyone's back from break. We're going to move on to social and emotional learning with COVID-19. Um, this week, we are going to talk about protecting others and wearing your mask. Last week, we did an experiment about how important it is to wash your hands. A lot of you like that, so um, we're going to wash our hands and talk about how it's important to protect others and using masks. So who knows why we wear masks? Go ahead and type in the chat if you know why we wear masks, or raise your hand if you know why we wear masks. And Miss Yaya or Mr. Connor will call on you to answer. Um, masks protect everyone. Like masks stop, stop the spread of diseases and infections. So what it says down here is COVID-19 is mainly spread through talking, sneezing, coughing, and breathing. Droplets and 
I can't see what that says, but um, come from the person doing that. If you wear a cloth mask, it can stop those particles from contacting others. This will stop the spread of COVID-19. So if you have the medical mask, the cloth mask, the designed mask, any mask, but it's just important that you wear a mask so you're not spreading any spit, saliva, any of that to other people so they don't get sick or you pass it and you don't know that you pass it. Um, can anybody tell me why wearing mask is important? Raise your hand or type it in the chat why wearing mask is important. Let me know, give me some feedback. Um, you guys are gonna get some good answers, so I have faith in you to give me good answers as to why masks are important and why we should wear them, especially in a time like this where we are in a pandemic. Um, wearing a mask is important because masks protect others from a virus. Someone could have the virus and not know it. This could mean asymptomatic or pre-symptomatic. So, you know when someone's sick or you know you're sick, you show the symptoms. And the symptoms are like a fever, um, cold chills, coughing. Those are symptoms. So, if you see those symptoms, then that means that you probably have the flu or something. You don't know, but somebody with COVID-19, somebody could have COVID-19 and not show any symptoms. And that is the most dangerous part about COVID-19. You could have COVID-19 and not show any symptoms, but still get somebody else sick and they could have symptoms. So that's why um, it's really important to wear your mask and why COVID-19 is like really scary to people and why people are uncertain and unsure about it. Um, mask on. Wearing a mask protects other people, but it can also protect yourself. It can also like stop you from getting something from somebody else if you have your mask on. If somebody else doesn't have their mask on, but you have your mask on, you are more likely to be safer. Um, don't forget, it's also very important to social distance. So at least the least amount of feet you need to be from someone is six feet apart. And also wash your hands. We talked about that last week and how important that is. It stops the spread of germs. Um, and just together, if we try and stop this virus and just try to make the numbers go down, we can beat this virus. Like, I just... I want you guys to understand how it's important to wear your mask and work together because no one person is going to make this virus or make these problems go away. Um, next, we are going to do an activity that shows you how important masks are. Uh, please go get a piece of paper. If you have a mask um, in your house, get that. If you have a t-shirt or cloth that you can put over your mouth, just get something that you can um, do the activity with and I'm gonna put you in breakout rooms and a counselor is gonna show you how to do it just like we did last week how we did an experiment and we did stuff it's the same thing this week but just a different activity um, so the mask activity is first you're gonna blow on a paper without your mask and then you're gonna put your mask on and put the paper in front of your face and blow on the paper and see what happens when you blow on the paper with your mask and without the mask. So seeing the difference between those two things. Um, did everyone enjoy the activity? If you did, I hope you uh, show others the activity. Um, but now that you guys understand why it's important to always wear a mask, and I hope you guys enjoyed today's lesson a lot. I learned a lot. I loved it a lot. So um, I hope you guys like it. Um, and I know you guys see this adorable, adorable mask, or ugh, mask, <laughs> this adorable, adorable dog who's saying, wear your mask. So don't wear your mask for me. You should wear your mask for me, but wear your mask for this dog, because this dog is adorable. Um, so we're going to go into another break. Um, Pick a song you would like us to play. We're taking suggestions. We'll try and get to everyone's song. If we don't play your song on our regular Zoom call, then we'll play your song in office hours. But please give us songs. We want to um, hear songs that you guys like. We want to play songs that you guys like. So um, pick a song for us to play and 
get up and dance with us. We're going to be dancing. I know everyone sees Mr. Connor dancing and sees like Miss Yaya, Miss Jasmine dancing, Miss Ariana. We want to see you dance. Okay, um, next we are going to get into Thirsty Thursday. We are going to show this video. It is a catch video just letting you know about nutrition and everything. So I think you should be all good on that. I'll show that separately. And then everybody, don't forget to finish all your independent work, including your Moby Max. Please try and get on Moby Max at least twice a week. So you're doing the activities and everything that they have on Moby Max, including like your math and reading. This is like separate from your reading packets and your math packets. Um, remember um, that you need to put your name on all your independent work. If you do it and you don't put your name on it, we can't give you points for it because we don't know whose is whose. We usually just take the work out and put it in a stack. So if your name's not on it and it's in the stack, we don't know whose it is. So please do me a favor, finish all your work and put your name on all your work. Um, remember, we start Zoom at 10.30 a.m. on Friday, which is tomorrow. So when you um, when you get ready to get on Zoom, we are not getting on at 1 o'clock like we usually do. Monday to Thursday is 1 o'clock. But on Fridays, it is at 10 a.m. And we will be with uh, Mr. BHB again, where he's going to be giving us videos and showing us a good dance routine. So... Hopefully we can have fun with that. But um, again, stay for office hours if you need to take a pretest, like your fitness pretest or where in the world. If none of these sound familiar to you, then you probably haven't taken it. So please stay so we can get your pretest in and get your pretest done. It will only take like five minutes. It won't take long. Um, but we are also playing fun games in uh, office hours. So if you want to see and stay for a fun game, then you should stay in office hours. Also, if I didn't get to your music request in, off in the regular Zoom call, it will get played in office hours, so. But remember, office hours, 2.30, 3.30. Other than that, I'm pretty sure that's all I got for you guys today. Um, thank you for listening. Also, if you miss the Zoom call or need to come back to the Zoom call just for like the SEO COVID or any instructions, this video will be on our YouTube channel, Lead the Way Learning Academy, and you'll be able to find it. So um, that's all I have for you today, but I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye.